In this video, we are going to see how we can use Excel application activities to open and close Excel files. For this, Excel application activities includes four activities like open Excel instance and close Excel instance, open workbook and close workbook activities. Open Excel instance and close Excel instance, these two activities are major and mandatory activities which are used to open and close excel application instance the point to here note is that they don't actually open the actual excel file they only opens an instance of ms office excel in order to open actual excel file we need to use open workbook and close workbook activities let's see how we can use these four activities in our automation if you remember this hello world project is created by us in one of our previous videos if you not have seen that i would recommend please go back into the series of in this playlist and watch this that video we have already created this hello world automation we will create another automation in order to explore these excel activities In this automation, I would use first open Excel instance activity. What this activity do is it will open an Excel instance. We can go into the information of this activity and we can read about it. It says it is a mandatory activity to drop when using MS Excel. It opens an M instance of MS Excel and once you open an Excel instance, you can use other MS Excel activities. If we run it, it will show us an Excel instance open. If we see in the below taskbar, one of the Excel instance has been opened. But it, it is an empty Excel instance. We will close this Excel instance and we will try to open a file. I have already created an Excel file in my local storage. The path of this Excel file is inside of my, my C drive temp folder and employees.xls if i will open this file it has this data i will close this file and try to open it this file using activities in order to open one of the excel file we have to use activity open workbook there are two open workbook activities available which is open workbook under without excel file without excel application and another open workbook which is un under the workbook i will use this open workbook activity which is under the drop down of workbook i will select this activity and it asks for two parameters workbook path and open options if i will explore what are the different open options i will click on this open options and click on create custom data it gives me three options or parameters one of the first parameter is open password second one is write password and update links open password and write password refers to the conditions where 
the our excel contains password for opening the file and passwords for writing something inside the file but since we don't have like that conditions in our excel we will not use them we will leave them blank in the workbook path i will enter the path of my excel file i will copy the path of this excel file by right click and copy as path and i will paste that path here the no the point to note here is that while entering the path in this parameter we don't need to provide code double quotes after entering the path i will click on this drop down below and i will save the automation then i will run the automation again this time it should open employees.xls file and it has done the job perfectly i will close this file manually and let's explore how we can close the workbook and close excel instance for closing the workbook i will search for the activity close workbook activity and again i will pick the close workbook activity which is available under the drop down workbook in close workbook activity it shows me one of the parameter which has name like has to save this parameter is useful when we have written something inside the excel file and we want to save then we can provide the value true here but since there is nothing we have written we can keep it as false which means it will just close the file and it will not save the file if i will run the automation again what should happen is that it will open the excel instance it will it will open the workbook and close the workbook but excel instance will not be closed because we have not used close excel instance activity but we will not the these activities will be too much rapidly executed that we will not notice that excel has been opened so what we can do is we can use an activity called wait this wait activity allows us to delay the automation at this particular step by giving it a delay time out in second in milliseconds this parameter accepts the delay time out in milliseconds so we will give 3000 which will stop this automation at this activity for 3 seconds i will run the automation again if you see it has opened the excel file it is has waited and closed the excel instance closed the excel workbook but it has not closed the excel instance so i will close this excel instance manually and then use the activity close excel instance right now what should happen is it will open the workbook it will wait for 3 seconds it will close the workbook and also close the excel instance and it has worked perfectly the one more thing which we can explore is that open excel instance activity comes with two parameters which says visible and display alerts visible refers to the fact that uh, excel instance is visible or not if we set it to false the excel op operations will be performed in the background and it will not be visible on the screen the second input parameter display alerts refers to the alerts which we see when we open excel some of the excel files 
If we set it to false, the bot will ignore those alerts. Thank you everyone. Let's meet you in next video.